not just physicians, it should be said, but also nurses, social workers, other healthcare workers, all of us advocating for improved Medicare for all. Now what we mean by improved is that we've really got to, with the traditional Medicare program, move to complete coverage of dental, hearing, um, vision, and long-term care. We have bills in Congress, one in the House by Representative Jayapal, one in the Senate by Senator Bernie Sanders. Uh, these are really good proposals. The other thing we're very concerned about at this time is the for-profit entity within the Medicare program. Medicare Advantage is really ripping off the government money, frankly, for Medicare beneficiaries. And in addition to that, just this year, the program is being introduced in 2023 called ACO Reach. And what this program will do is actually introduce for profit entities into the traditional Medicare program so that we may in fact be going and moving in the direction of you know a for profit Medicare program, which I think is really against the principle of Medicare for all. Thank you very much. We're here though to celebrate you know, the 57th birthday of this really important marvelous program. And I do want to note that uh, Senator Gillibrand is a co sponsor of Senator Sanders' bill. And, and I believe that before Senator Schubert became majority leader, he was supportive of the idea too. But now that he's in his leadership role, things are a little different. It's a little different. <laughs> exactly. The only thing I just want to say about Medicaid, because I don't want to forget about Medicaid, Medicaid has proven over and over and over again over the years to be such an important program for America and for New Yorkers, particularly in moments of public health crises. I can't imagine what we would be like if we took have dealt in the last two and a half years with the COVID-19 pandemic without the Medicaid program being available for us. It has absolutely been a bedrock. It was created as a coverage program, but it has grown to be so much more than that over the 57 years now. It's our long-term care program. It's an important public health program for us. So I just want to acknowledge uh, the really importance of Medicaid. Uh, it is by far the largest health care program in the United States now. We've put over a million New Yorkers and benefited from Medicaid just during the pandemic. Um, and so it's really an important program. We want to celebrate, lift up, and celebrate that program. So, uh, remarks from yourselves or from the Senator's offices, if you like. I don't, I don't know what I can add, but just okay. first I would say, you know what? I think we mentioned the $2,000 cap uh, on out-of-pocket uh, out drugs, so that obviously is a yeah, big, the new big, big bill. as well. Yeah. Yeah. So we just have to pass it down. We'll look at it next week. Um, and on behalf of Senator Chuck Schumer, I just want to thank all of you for your energy. We've got to thank you for your work. 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 And I want to, uh, to also echo on um, behalf of Senator Gillibrand of what uh, Eric and Senator Schubert's office said. Without your support, without your advocacy, without your hard work and dedication, um, these programs would not have the strength or the faith of passion uh, or the uh, forward. You, your passion, your dedication is what gives these, uh, uh, helps these programs have things and gives them life. It's a partnership between um, classic community organizing periods. You have your inside team and your outside team. 
the guys on the inside team and the outside team. We work together to make good things happen. And uh, we really particularly want to thank Senator Schumer and Senator Tillerich for their leadership on the latest bill, the inflation reduction act, together with all of us Republicans. It was, it's come back from the dead so many times, and now it looks like it's finally going to happen, and we couldn't have done it without leadership from both of the senators. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you.